Hi, I'm Danielle Graham, and I'm in my kitchen at home with my gorgeous girlfriends. And I'm going to teach them today to cook a few dishes from my new cookbook on the table at home. Today we're going to be cooking tan shao pao with vegetables and a Chinese style of steamed fish. So we're making a tan shao pao vegetables together today and we're going to make it a little team effort so everyone's um, got something to do. Well, you can always put in any like, extra ingredients if you want, right? Correct. Like any other vegetables that you Correct, 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 correct. Whatever tickles your fancy, whatever you like. So today we, we were cooking in my kitchen at home and I had some of my friends come over and I was teaching them how to make a few dishes from the book. Really simple, fresh and tasty dishes. Not that difficult to execute. Okay, now we have everything nicely prepared and chopped and ready to go. Firstly, we're going to fry some ginger and some garlic. So how long do you cook these for? Like, do they get... But just so they kind of soften a little bit, not brown. You don't want them to be brown. We kind of put in the hardest to the softest in terms of vegetables. So we'll get in the carrots and the celery. So the trick is to constantly stir. I think it is, so that everything gets a good coating. My book was inspired uh, from my passion of eating and cooking, which was instilled in me from a young age by my Chinese mother and my Irish dad. And I grew up eating home-cooked food, and so sharing a meal together on the table was really important, and which is the theme of my book. And having home-cooked meals was something that we look forward to. You know, if it's a little bit dry, you could add a little bit of water, a bit of soy sauce if you want to add a little bit more extra flavor. All right. This is so my this dish. Is, yeah, this is your vegetable. So we've moved on to my next dish that we're making today, which is Chinese-style steamed fish. We're using a whole fish today. We're using a snapper. Okay, so we're going to pour a few things over the fish before we steam it. So we have Shaoxing wine, which kind of takes away the fishy smell. And we have some mushroom water that we've soaked the shiitake mushrooms in. Pour it all over. And then we put some fresh ginger on top. All right, it's ready to go in. I chose the title because it really is about home cooking and what I serve at home. The, yeah. the, the meat is, is white. So it just cannot be it's translucent. Kind of and you can, these mushrooms are already cooked. They're pre-cooked. They're pre-cooked. Mm -hmm. This is the peanut oil. This kind of has to be scalding. This is our Chinese style steamed fish with shiitake mushrooms. How's the san chao pao, girls? So chao good. Mmm. Mm. Oh my god, babe, it's so good. Mm. Wow, I like Very the sound effects. <laughs> it's very light, you know? It's it is. Light and it is. And fresh. I hope that with the book, you know, I'm able to share my passion for home-cooked food, for getting around the table and spending time together with your loved ones, family, friends, and having that togetherness and sharing a meal, you know, and I think that there's nothing better.